Oh, there we go. Taking it out. Everybody, this is Red Gamer 25. Welcome back to Let's Play Minecraft MC Nostalgia. Yes, we've gone back to Greenland because I want to spend an episode in here. And now we are in 12W01A, the final snapshot for 1.1. Let me read out the changes. Added 18 new language translations, removed four language translations. World type re added world type after being removed in infdev. Super flat. Completely flat world composed of grass blocks, dirt, and bedrock. Also generates villages. Added world type selection and options menu. Currently only default and super flat. You can't customize them just yet. Only the classic flat is available at the moment. Beaches. We added beaches after being removed in Bay 1.8. Biomes, slightly smooth color translations between biomes. Add proper color transitions for the duck and swamp biomes into other biomes. Change biomes to be slightly more varied. No, varied. I don't know how to say it. Examples of which being hills and forests and deserts. Village. A single chest is generated in each blacksmith building. Brewing, reduce brewing time to 20 seconds. Enchanting, decrease randomness of enchantment tables. Spawn egg, change spawn eggs colors to better represent their respective mobs they spawn. Spawn eggs also reordered in creative inventory ladders. Remove collision blocks from ladders, meaning they are no longer solid and cannot be stored on. And last but not least, fence gates. Update the fence gate collision and hitbox to a line with fences. And that's it. So yeah, 1.1 is not really a big update from 1.0. It's just a few minor things like adding languages and super flat worlds and that. 1.2 is when the new stuff is when more stuff really start does get added. Right now, I just want to cut some down uh, some trees in case we need them. I fell from that fin again and I died once again. In between episode 166 and 167, this is episode 168. That's enough wood. Sun's going down. Here we go. I know there's a diamond saw in that chest over there, but I'm not going to take it out, and I'm not going to explain why if you've watched some of my 
previous episodes. I'll tell you right now, because that will take me back to the Kazo Caverns. I think we should block this off. Oops. Okay. We'll get all across all the way here. Oh, there we go. Taking it out. Hmm. This is useless. I think we might tear this down. I think it's finally time to tear down this mob spawner. Luckily, I've got my bucket. Because this never worked anyway. Don't even know why I even kept it. Got it. Got the water. Okay. Oops. Oh yeah, we don't need the glass anyway. I know the ground level, however, will stay, however. I'm not going to cut that down. Whoops! Burn out all those signs. Got it. I think we can fit a little bit more in. Hmm. Oh, sorry. Didn't realize I was on peaceful. Maybe I should stop doing that, you know. It's really bad manners. What should I throw out? Gotta be some I can throw out. I think I might throw this out. Don't need it.
There we go, the old mob grinder has finally been torn down. Don't need it anymore. Hmm. Those signs will stay. We assume we should put the, all the flowers back. Don't know why the flowers are gone though. Back to eating the food. This way. Wait, there's a way in. back in this world again. Yeah, I might want to build a house out there one day. Hmm. Sometimes it takes a while for me to record episodes because sometimes I could be struggling on what to do in an episode. Some of this out. Get rid of this dirt. There we go. Got that dirt. Now I can refill in that hole that the creeper blew up a few episodes ago. Yeah, this land seems so empty without any trees, you know. Ends up burnt them all away. Maybe we should burn away all the trees in Greenland since they're all corrupted, you know? This way towards the heart. Here we go. Time to refill all this back in. And it's back. I think this is about it for this episode. This is Rick Gamer 75 signing off. Thanks for watching. See you again in the next one. Peace out. Oh.